Hi guys and welcome back to our FIFA 19 Sunderland Road to Glory career mode. Now I just want to quickly apologise that it has been a short while or about a week or so since the last episode. If you follow me on Instagram you'd know that a piece of my recording equipment, it sadly, well it died basically. I mean it was impossible for me to record gaming videos but it's all sorted now so we're back. So again apologies for that and of course if you don't follow me on Instagram, follow me on Instagram. But this episode is all about the Champions League. We're going to be playing the two legs of the semi-final of the Champions League against Chelsea. So we have Chelsea first. I'm not sure whether that's home or away. It was just on the screen, but I failed to look. Yeah, we're at home. First leg is at home. And then we're going to be taking on Huddersfield, but that will be a simulated game. Then we'll do the second leg of the Champions League semi-final, again against Chelsea. And then simulate this game against Leeds. And then that will be the episode. So this episode, like I say, is all about the Champions League. And this is the team that we're going to be using in this first leg against Chelsea. We have Cabrera in goal, we have Zinchenko, Upamecano, Dominguez and Mbabu across the back. We have Diaz and Condogbia as the central midfielders with Mount just in front of them. We have Carrasco on the left, Davies on the right and Dennis up top. It's a very, very attacking side. Hopefully we can just get goals at home and I really, really can't afford to concede in this leg. We can't be giving away away goals. Let's get into it. And here we are, guys, at the Stadium of Light. It is Condogbia leading us out today as we welcome Chelsea to the Stadium of Light. We'll have a quick check over Chelsea's team. And here is a reminder of the path which led us to here as well. Of course, we beat Benfica, Napoli along the way. Chelsea beat Leipzig and Inter Milan. And here is the Champions League music in which could potentially be the last time we hear this music at the stage of light if we do manage to get through to the Champions League final. There's Rabiot there for Chelsea, Eden Hazard of course starting as well, we know how dangerous that man could potentially be. Now here is the Chelsea starting 11, they have Kepa, Alonso, Murillo, Paulista, Calabria, Rabiot, Jorginho, Kante, Hazard, Neres and Martinez up top, that is a very solid side indeed. Come on, lads. Come on, get across from it. It's Neres. Gets it across goal. And it's headed away by Pagano. Good start here from Chelsea. Neres, incredibly dangerous. The young lad down the right-hand side. And they've taken their corner. They've whipped it in. It has been headed and saved at the near post by Cabrera. Really good start this from Chelsea. And they do take it short. The next corner this time. Come on, get into him. It's too easy for Neres. Need to get it away. They're just keeping hold of the ball really well there, Chelsea. Get into him, get into him, away, that'll do. Now can we counter here? It's Mount, flick it inside for Carrasco. I can see Davies make a movement on that right side. Could this be the counter attack of dreams? It is Davies, still Davies, and he's gone for the near post. And it's a save. That's what we've got in our locker though, a lot of pace on the counter attack. It's been whipped in from the corner. It has been headed and it's a great save from Kepa. What an end to end start this has been. An absolute class save there. Whipped in again this time towards Dennis. He has headed it and that one's gone over the bar. Oh, here is Davies. Help him out. Davies, make your run. Inside, this is good stuff. Knock it again for Carrasco. Surely he's offside and he's hit it wide. Was he offside anyway? He was, thank God, because that would have been embarrassing. I, thought, I knew he was offside. Yeah, it was a mile off. How the hell has he, <laughs> how has he missed? That would have been embarrassing. Good stuff now and it is. Condogbia strikes one from distance and it's a great save from Kepper. Still Mount does get it in towards Carrasco and it has been headed away again. Come on, let's keep the pressure on and they're going to break here. Neres, so much pace, look how fast he is. Surely that's at least 99 acceleration there. He's so, so quick. Get into him, get into him. Still got the ball somehow, get it out. Jeez, what? He's given a penalty. He has given a penalty, and I did do, I did press to slide, but it's selected the completely wrong player to slide. I don't even really think he caught him, really. We'll have to look back at the replay, but this is absolutely ridiculous. I wanted Zinchenko to slide because he was running directly towards Zinchenko, but he quickly changed it itself to Condogbia. Oh, that takes the absolute pace, and it is Hazard now against Cabrera. Go on, son. It's Cabrera! Oh, and he goes the right way as well. But Hazard, the penalty is just too good. And they do have an away goal. We have a mountain to climb here. Oh, that takes the absolute piss. Here is Carrasco now. Gets it in. It is Mount on his scuffs his effort. And 
It just rolls easily for the defender to deal with. Well in. Go on, Dennis, lad. Here is Dennis now coming down this left side. Dennis, oh, he's lost the ball, but he does win it back. Help him out. Finds Kondogbia around the edge. One touch, then another. Still Kondogbia in his... Scuffed the shot. And there goes the half-time whistle. 1-0. Definitely not ideal. I don't think we've played particularly badly. It's just that pen that has really, really messed us over here. We're going to have to improve in the second half and put away our chances. At least finish this game level. Go on, David Son. He's so much faster than Alonso. Come on. He does get it in. Get you in it. Diaz with the header and it's a great save. Well directed. Maybe just not enough power on it. It's a good start. Dennis, flick it on. It is Davies now. Gets it in towards Dennis. What a save. How on earth have we not scored here? Kepper is on absolute fire. Carrasco with the corner towards Kondogbia. It has been headed. Sure that took a deflection. Surely it has taken a deflection. A corner has been given. Get it in again. Decent ball headed away this time. It's Calabria now coming down this right side. They do get it in. Get it away. Well played, Dominguez. Probably the best he could have done. I don't know what the hell Cabrera is playing out there, but it's a corner. I can just sense a goal here. They've just done so much one-touch passing. It's just been impossible for us to get it off him. Here we go. Surely it's a great save by Cabrera. Well in, son. Class, class keeper. You just no one is a chance coming for them because this one-touch passing just comes out of nowhere. Go on, Dennis. There's a great ball for Carrasco to get on to. Come on, cut back inside. That's it. Help him out. Whips in towards Kondogbia heading. It's in! 84 minutes in. And it's Kondogbia who gets the equaliser. Get in! The last sort of 10, 20 minutes have been all Chelsea. It's the first time we've managed to get forward. Whipped in with pace. And there is Kondogbia who flings himself in front of his marker. Kepa can only get a touch on it. As he absolutely buries it home. Get in! Subs have come on but it's all too late now. They brought Abraham on and Maitland Niles, but Bull has been out of play for a while. And there goes the full time whistle. I'll take it one all. Probably not ideal that they've got themselves an away goal, but at least we haven't lost this one. But now we are going to be going into this game against Huddersfield at home. Of course, we're going to be simulating it, but we will have a quick recap of the league table because it has been a while. United four points ahead of us. Our goal difference is relatively similar now as well only four goals out there four goals above us Spurs and Chelsea seem to have been long gone Liverpool City Arsenal in fifth sixth and seventh bottom of the league we do have Bournemouth Leeds and Stoke could have in 12th which isn't too bad for them really but like I say we are going to simulate this game now hopefully we can still continue with putting the pressure on Manchester United at the top come on lads come on do us a favor do us a favor and we win 2-0 McTominay and Hendo getting the goals there. But now we're getting back into it, away from home at Stamford Bridge, the second leg of the Champions League semi-final. And due to fitness reasons and injuries, of course, Ampadu is out for the remainder of the season. I'm gonna have to tinker with it again, like we did in the last episode, where I'm pretty sure we played three at the back, including one centre-back and two uh, wing-backs as well. So this should be interesting. So this is the team that we're gonna go with, and it looks terribly scary. Also very exciting in terms of attacking, but this could go horribly, horribly wrong, but it's the best we can do because we only have one fully fit centre-back, and that is Upper Meccano. So we've got Cabrera in goal, we have Riveros, Upper Meccano and Mbabu across that back three with Grujic and Maitland-Niles in midfield with Carrasco on the left, Davies on the right, we have Mount as the can with Dennis or Martinez up top. Please, EA gods, give us a chance. Let's get into it. And here we are at Stamford Bridge, which is arguably the biggest game of this series so far win this and we are through to the Champions League final which is pretty much the be all and end all of this series anyway so this is massively massively important that we get a win here otherwise it's back at square one I'm absolutely shitting myself to be honest with you come on lads it's a makeshift lineup but I believe we can do it come on here is Grujic now down the line for Carrasco Get it in, get it in, it's Carrasco, still Carrasco, drag it, saved, and it looks like they're going to clear it away, they have done, good start again here, Loftus cheat today, starting for Chelsea, who we really wanted to sign in January, but unfortunately we just didn't have the funds to pull off the move, and they have a chance here that they've lashed at, and it's flew wide by Latoro Martinez, 
Well in. Davies, make your run over the top. You do have the pace, Dennis. His blistering pace down this right side. Go on, take him. That's it. Go on, son, get it in. Oh, that's not the best of balls, really. Picked out the wrong man. We're intercepting it really well here. And that's a dangerous pass, but we do manage to keep hold of it. Knock it on for Marco Grujic. Carrasco now holding on to it. Here's Maitland Niles. He takes a touch. He does go for himself. It's an absolute beauty from Ashley. Maitland Niles, the player that we basically just picked up because we could simply afford him. And he's just scored an absolute beauty at one of the most crucial times of this entire series. Get in. Holding on to it patiently. Carrasco on to Maitland Niles. One touch and then bang right into that top corner. Kepa had no chance. And we are now in the driving seat in this tie. Get in. We've been so good defensively so far, intercepting everything, making some brilliant challenges all over the park, and we're just countering for the lives of us, as we can see here, it is Carrasco, up against Loftus-Cheek, who's catching up with him pace-wise, it is still Carrasco, he does get it in towards the back post, and no one's there, there goes the half-time whistle, a brilliant, brilliant performance, this formation has worked an absolute treat, funnily enough, in this game, they've had nowhere near as many chances as they did in the previous leg and it's that Maitland Niles scorcher that puts us in the lead good chance now it is Neres we know the pace he does have and that's a great challenge there from Riveros brilliantly done just get it away oh no it has kept it in Neres brilliantly that's yours Cabrera well in can we get a counter attack going here make your move Dennis over the top front to chase is it a bit too much it's not he does keep hold of it Dennis Go on, so help him out, help him out, help him out. Not much assistance here at all. But here is Grujic now, picks it up. Maitland Niles, can he turn again? Help him out. Tries to find Niles. Can he get there? Dennis! What a save! If only Niles went for the shot, which I really think he should have done. It would have been easier on a right foot there, but Maitland Niles has just left it. Dennis just took over and dragged it with his left. That should have been game over. It is Carrasco now with the corner to the near post, and it's too easy for Kepa. And he's held it really easily there. Well in Davies now. Grujic on to Niles. There's a good counter attack here. And it's Carrasco. Big touch there from Carrasco. Still Carrasco comes inside. Hits it. And it's gone in. I thought it hit the side there too. But it hasn't. It's gone in. I think Epper may have got a touch yet again. But too much power. And it hits the back of the net. Get in. It looks like now we are definitely going to the Champions League final. Absolute scenes. I honestly thought he just lashed it into the side netting on. I was a bit pissed off, but he's come inside. He's absolutely smashed it, and that's a brilliant finish there, tucking it in. Carrasco, he's probably been one of our players of the season. He's been excellent all season long. Get in. Lays it on for Niles. He hits it again, and it's a save this time from Kepa. This is more like it. This formation, I feel like we should just carry on with it. Because it's worked so, so well. It is Carrasco with the corner. It's not a great one this time. Oh, here is Dennis. Still Dennis. Strikes it himself and it's a save by Kepa. And there goes a the full-time whistle. We are going to the Champions League final. That makeshift formation just worked absolutely amazingly. And probably one of the best performances we've seen in quite some time. Even with the three at the back. They didn't seem to bother us whatsoever, but I think just because we had so many bodies forward, they could not cope with us whatsoever. Get in! But now, after we have come away from that incredibly dramatic and amazing Champions League semi-final win, we're going to simulate this game against Leeds. Come on, lads. And we win 2-0. Gomez and Abraham with the goals for us in that one. So, guys, that will be the end of the episode, but we will have a quick check on the calendar to see if it has come out who we're playing we are going to be playing Real Madrid in the Champions League final which is absolutely insane but that will not be in the next episode the next episode we will play the four games previous to that we'll probably simulate the Fulham and West Ham game we will play the FA Cup final against Manchester City and then of course the final Premier League game of the season which just happens to come against Newcastle and then the next episode after that could potentially be the finale of the entire series if we manage to win it. But that will be the end of the episode and we'll quickly recap the league table. As you can see there, Manchester United have, well they do have a game in hand over us, but we're only a point 
behind them. So that is how the league table looks as the episode is going to end. United top, we're second, Chelsea third, Spurs in fourth. The bottom three are made up of Bournemouth, Leeds and Stoke. So if you have enjoyed the episode, guys, please hit the like button for me. It would be massively, massively appreciated. And subscribe to the channel if not already to become a fully-fledged member of the Sony Army. But for now, you take care and stay jolly. Yes.